So with Cooper, what we normally do, we first put him into a set, right? And then lure him into the down position. As you can see, he pops up. You can try out a bunch of different tactics to try and get him to lay down, he won't do it. So we have a different way of teaching him down, and that's what we're going to use today. Here he is, and what I'm going to do is throw food underneath my legs. He goes for food. Now we're in the down position. He gets fed in this position a bunch. Then I relieve pressure. And here we are. With Cooper laying down, getting a bunch of treats. What a fun place to be, huh? Bring around this side. So I'll bring him a little bit further down until that butt goes in. There it is. Yes, and he gets the treat when he's laying down completely. Good boy, Cooper. Very good boy. Try it from a different angle so you can see. Yeah. Yes, much faster. So we keep doing this. So Cooper becomes comfortable with just lying down like that. Ooh. Hang on, buddy. Oh, we had a gas. Try again, ready? Oh, okay. Here we go. Look. So in this case, he's running out of gas. He's Getting a little tired, so I'm gonna make it a little bit easier by just throwing the food on the ground. There's less expectation about food on the ground. And there we go, yes, good boy. So if we do this enough times, he starts to develop this understanding of what we want, which is him laying down. And once we get that understanding, even in this context, then we can start translating it to other contexts, like just standing up and asking Cooper to lay down, or being lured down. Right now, we're making big progress. Big progress now, Cooper. Yeah.